morning, everyone, and happy Monday. You guys, I am still just feeling very grateful. Very grateful and happy and overwhelmed with all the love that was shown to Canyon yesterday. I don't know why it is just like, it's just filling, <laughs> filling my soul with happiness. Um, I absolutely love hosting our family and people that we love in our home. It is truly one of my favorite things. And just being able to have everyone from mine and Cody's family here yesterday, it was just really special to me. And I'm just still really, really happy about that. That feeling has not worn off yet. So it is Monday morning. I actually just got home from Cohen's preschool class. Today was bring a pet to class and show all the classmates. You guys, Pepper's the best dog in the world. We are so grateful for him. He is amazing, but he is very hyper and very rambunctious. And I was thinking that a classroom full of preschool students might only enhance that. <laughs> so Cohen asked if he could bring one of the leopard geckos to class today. And um, I was talking to Dakota and Carson about it and they decided that Wasatch would be the better one to take because he's a little bit more calm. And Aspen, the female, she gets a little anxious um, around a lot of people. So I was able to take Wasatch to Cohen's class this morning and it was so much fun. The kids loved it. They had never seen a leopard gecko before. And it was really funny because some of the kids that were very hesitant and didn't want to be anywhere near it when I first brought him out of the box, they were so in love with him by the time I left. They were petting, I told them to use one little finger and they took turns petting the top of his head while I was holding him and it was just really cute. So I just got home from Cohen's preschool class doing that, it was so much fun. He has a field trip this Wednesday at a petting zoo that I get to go with him on. So lots of fun end of the school year activities still going on here, you guys. It is May madness. I'm sure all of you parents and grandparents, even aunts and uncles out there know that May with end of the year like sports games and dance recitals and field trips and graduations and end of the year testing and projects, it's, it's chaotic. It's a lot, but we are so excited because we're just a few weeks away from summer vacation. So we are in the full swing of May Madness right now. I'm trying to make sure that I write everything down both on my physical calendar and in my phone just so I don't forget or miss anything. But you guys, most of all, I just wanted to get on here and say happy Monday. I hope you have a great day. I say this a lot on Instagram, but I don't really know if I convey it here. And I just wanted to say that every day when I wake up, especially Mondays, I don't know why. I think it just feels like a fresh start. I think how cool is it that we get to set the tone of our day? Seriously, I know that seems like such a simple thing, but if you really think about it, like I can make today whatever I want it to be. And I do that by the attitude that I have, right? So I just, you guys, today I am choosing to have an unbelievable day and it's gonna be a great week. And I want you guys to have an awesome day and week as well. Whatever it is that you're hoping to accomplish, I hope you crush it. Let's go get out there. I got some chores to do. I got to upload the vlog and I really, really want to get outside in the sunshine and go for a walk. Oh, Co, is that awesome? Hey, hey welcome home from school. Look at you, Lynn. Hey, how was the rest of your day after mom left? Good. What other animals did you meet? Puppies. Puppies? How many? This much. Two? Yeah. Nice. <gasps> that is so cool. And did you practice for your graduation? Yeah. Awesome. is just about the sweetest thing ever. He doesn't take naps very often anymore, but almost every day that he has school, he does. And I love it just because I know that he played so hard and he had a good time. Um, you guys, I have been busy planning McKinley's birthday party. She will be six, six years old a week from today. And I can't even believe it. I feel like with the May Madness that I was talking about earlier and then Mother's Day and Kenyon's baptism and McKinley's birthday, it is just lots of planning. So I've been trying to coordinate with my mother-in-law and my mom and everyone for Mother's Day plans this weekend. And then we also have McKinley and Cohen's um, end of the year dance recitals this weekend. And McKinley has a big four hour gymnastics tryout. So we've got a lot going on, but 
um, I wanted to get planning her birthday party before things get too busy. So I am just creating an invitation right now, working on it so that we can get them printed this week and pass them out. Just trying to figure out what day would work best was a little bit tricky, but she's wanting a unicorn birthday party. And when we were picking out some of the paperware and stuff for the baptism, she was showing me exactly what she wanted. So we are going full unicorn, full girly, for full kin, and I'm so excited. So I'm working on that invitation now. school cars how's your day good yeah <laughs> what <laughs> okay it can go go to how was your day good yeah what did you do oh we are doing these new essays on like um a state in utah and we like she, we put our names in a, a jar in utah no i meant um a state in utah in the U.S.? In the U.S. Okay. <laughs> and we put um, our names in a bowl and she drew them and then you got to pick. I got picked first and I picked Ohio. <laughs> nice. Yeah. You guys don't know that's where my brother Jed went on his mission. Mm -hmm. Huh. Yeah. So Coda picked Ohio. That's cool. Are you done with the end of the year testing? No. Not yet? We, we're doing science right now and we're going to do math this week as well. Sweet. Well, awesome, Daddy. You getting excited for summer? Yeah. Okay. There's only 15 days of school left for us. That's insane. That means that there's like... 15 more. No. Yeah. 16 more alarms. That means that there's days. like 10 more for Kinley, and I think there's two more for Cohen. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. I was doing oil pulling. I don't know how many of you do that or know what that is, but I can't talk for like 20 minutes while I'm doing it and it was really funny. Kinley asked me if she could have a pop school. I said yes, but I was trying to tell her because there's a bunch of neighbor kids playing to not go outside and like show it off and I was trying to convey that without talking or opening my mouth and it was really funny. But I was trying to ask her how was school. She did not understand what I was saying. How was school for you, bud? Good. Yeah? Did you have fun? Does anyone ask you about your baptism? Okay, well, you get to go watch our, your vlog from the baptism because it's a good one. Okay. It was a good day, huh? And yes, we've officially entered popsicle season. Yeah. They're all like half empty. <laughs> What's up, guys? Made it home from work. Wrapped a big old food truck today, so that was kind of fun. But something came in the mail that I'm super excited for. It's the Ninja Creamy. It's been raved about on TikTok and Instagram all over the place, so I'm super interested to try it. Just bought it the other day. I'm an ice cream fanatic, so super excited to try it. But unfortunately, you have to like, it comes with these little cups. Right, right, there they are. These little cups that you have to freeze it for 24 hours before you ever like blend it together. So, can't be trying it today, but I'll definitely be mixing some stuff together to give it a try tomorrow. But I'm just super excited about that. No yawning. Sorry. <laughs> I'm closing out the vlog here, babe. Come on. Oh man. You guys, I planned on filming a lot this afternoon. <laughs> didn't happen. It didn't happen. Yeah, it didn't happen. Living our lives? It's just, it's real life, guys. Sometimes stuff comes up and you're just not able to do what you thought you could do. But really just wanted to take a minute and say how grateful I am for all of you and how grateful I am for these videos. I love being able to go back and watch certain things and certain moments and certain times in our life. It really means a lot to me. Yeah, it's like a 
journal basically big video journal and Kinley like I said her birthday is a week from today she'll be six weeks old and we started doing this when she she'll be six weeks old she'll be six years, years old years old and we started doing this when she was four weeks old it's crazy so you guys six years of our life documented here and I look back on the videos often and especially this afternoon and tonight I was and I'm just very grateful for them guys thank you so much for watching for all your comments and everything yes. just Real quick, we love you. Here are some of our top Valiant supporters. We love you guys. <laughs> we love you. There are so many of you and we just, we're so grateful. Yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye guys. Bye. <laughs> 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 <laughs>